Wes Morrow here with CIR Realty. Solar energy is a fast expanding industry with the potential to transform how we power our homes and businesses. With rising worries about climate change and a desire for more sustainable energy sources, as well as a rising energy prices, an increasing number of people are turning to solar power as a solution to save money while also providing a cleaner and more sustainable source of energy. And with the cost of solar panels falling and government incentives rising, there has never been a better moment to make the transition. But switching to solar might be intimidating, especially to people unfamiliar with the technology. That's why we're here today at Zeno Renewables, an Alberta-based company that specializes in high quality solar panels and expert installation services to learn a little bit more about the key benefits of solar and answer some frequently asked questions. Come on in, let's have a chat. Wes Morrow here with CIR Realty and I'm here with Kai and Gersh of uh, Zen Owner Renewables, uh, co-CEOs, and I'm just here to ask them a few questions about, uh, about solar and renewables. Uh, how's it going, guys? Awesome, good, good, how are you doing? No, not too bad, thanks. Uh, to start, could you tell us a little bit about uh, Zeno Renewables? Yeah, Zeno Renewables is a residential solar solutions company focused on installing solar on 1 million homes by 2040 and providing Canadians with a full turnkey offering of solar panels, battery storage, and electric vehicle charging stations for their homes. And it started in 2015 here in Calgary. And we currently operate in Edmonton and Calgary and serve most of Alberta with out of those two locations. At that time, in 2015, uh, we were both in the construction industry, we were working oil and gas jobs, and we started looking from the perspective of things like, what, how were we raised and what was important throughout our childhood? And we came to the realization that you know, being more environmentally friendly, being more conscious of the way that we consume our energy was something that we were capable of executing based on our education, which is being electricians. So we decided to take our electrical skills and put solar into the mix. It's great to see that you're so involved in uh, the community. Can you tell us a little bit more about some of the initiatives that you're involved in? Yeah, so the community is a big part of our uh, of the business and kind of what we like to do. Uh, the first one is city cleanup. So that started about four years ago. Um, it was a big thing that we were able to bring in and pretty much we go into areas within Calgary and within Edmonton where people think it's a clean area. Um, and we go and we bring volunteers, we bring team members and we bring sponsors as well now as of the last couple ones. I pretty much go in for an hour and a half and see how much we can find and clean up. And we're able to find those areas and make them cleaner for the individuals that are using them. And then another big one for us recently was the Calgary Surge. So we're the title sponsor for the Calgary Surge. They're the new CEBL basketball team that um, starts their season here end of May. And one of, one of the big things for that was sponsorship was community. They believe heavily in bringing all four quadrants of the city together and uniting individuals over the game of basketball, which is something that we heavily believe in. Um, so that was a big thing for us. And it was a symbol of what energy has to bring to Alberta and that energy as a whole is evolving and growing and that a renewable energy company can make that impact as well. Um, so yeah, community is a huge piece of our company for us. So moving on to renewable energy. Um, so maybe just kind of give us an idea of like, why would people want to move to uh, renewable energy and, and what are the benefits? Can you maybe just talk to a little bit about that? Though we've built entire infrastructure with natural gas and coal and things of these nature, amazing technologies that have allowed us to get to where we are. What does that next step look like? Are we supposed to just stop as a nation? No, we need to continue moving forward and setting that example. So that's the first layer that renewable energy comes into play is that we have an opportunity to lead. We've always been a leader. We need to continue doing that. The second piece is electricity bills. They're crazy. Like they've been going through the roof. There's no stability in the market. We're in a deregulated market, specifically here in Alberta. That means that some forces can come into play and the electricity prices could spike through the roof. And we've seen that consistently over the last few years. Solar is the equivalent of buying 25 years of electricity up front and buying it at a cost that you know is fixed and then hedging that in your favor. So you're significantly reducing your electricity bills. And in some cases, if the system is designed correctly, eliminating it over the balance of the year. And the last piece, and I save this for last because this is always uh, known with solar, it's significantly more environmentally friendly. Every single solar panel that gets installed does have a carbon footprint. But the reality is that carbon footprint isn't for the lifetime of the system, it's only for a small period of time. We're getting really close to a point in time where pulling resources out of the ground and turning them into usable panels 
only has a carbon footprint that's satisfied in the first year. So you plug in a solar panel, you start generating energy, and it offsets the carbon it took to create it in the first year. It's great for the country and us being leaders. It's fantastic for your personal finances, and it satisfies us being Canadian, which is you know taking care of the environment and conserving nature as it should be. So a lot of people are just going to have kind of concerns about costs. So can you speak a little bit to that? And, uh, you know, I know a lot of people want to know about the payback as well. So I, ideally cost, a big question that always comes up. An average home in Alberta uses about 8,500 kilowatt hours. Now, what that looks like is that you have to install about 20 panels to offset that. The cost for that is, is around $20,000, 20 to $23,000. Um, the nice thing is there's a federal grant available, which is $5,000. So you get $5,000 off of that price. And then there's also a $40,000 interest-free loan um, that you can get approved for um, through the federal government that will allow you to do a 10-year amortization for the loan itself. So really, really good programs in place. Um, we're seeing paybacks around the seven to nine year mark, give or take. I think Gersh mentioned before, if you're looking at energy prices, every time energy prices increase, the payback goes up. Um, and there's something that is obviously going up a lot lately. Um, a lot of individuals have seen the classic, almost kind of with mortgage side of things, where now they're renewing. And that's when this impact really hits. So we've had a lot of clients like, hey, I was at six cents and now my renewal is 13. Like, what are we doing with solar? We need to get on this. Um, and that's one thing too that we look at though is, Lock in your energy rates. Don't go onto the floating right now when it comes to that. Really dial in, lock in the energy rates and make sure that you're secured from that side and then look at the solar aspect. For someone who is considering uh, renewable energy but is on the fence, what kind of insights would you give them uh, in order to kind of make them, you know, make a decision? Yeah, for people considering renewable energy and they're on the fence, now is a really good time to go solar. And the reason being is because of all the programs that are available. There's a limited time that these programs will become avail that are available, and there's a reality that they might not come back. And the reason why we can say that with confidence is that solar without the incentives, so the line of credit and the $5,000 off, already made sense. So as the market continues to ramp up, the chances of those incentives being in play may or may not be there. So if you're on the fence and you don't know if you want to do it or not, start off with our website. A lot of information is there. There's a significant amount of blogs, information that's focused on providing information to those who do want to seek it out themselves. And then we recommend filling out a form and talking to one of our specialists. It's a no pressure situation. You can ask as many questions as you want. And our job ultimately is a first step is to educate the individuals out there because you know that education leads to empowerment and empowerment leads to decisions. So the reality is it's easy, but you have to pick how easy you want it to be. We've been around for a fair amount of time now, and there's some other companies in the market that have been around for a long time as well too. And the trusted companies are really easy to spot. Are they trying to rush you to the contract or are they willing to give you the information on the front end? So just make sure that when you're reaching out to individuals and you wanna to go to, through a process that you know is going to be successful, be considerate on the front end. Make sure that you're picking a com good company. Check their Google reviews. Are they winning awards? Are they you know, in the community and things of that nature? If those check boxes are satisfied, then it's a really easy thing to do and it's definitely a good time to do it. All right, well, really appreciate your time today, guys, and uh, I definitely learned a little bit more uh, today as well. So, uh, you know, really appreciate it, and uh, I think I'm gonna be uh, checking in with you guys and seeing what we can do about getting solar on my place. So, yeah, 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 yeah awesome, right, thanks. thanks. So that's a wrap for our Zeno Renewables interview. I hope you learned a little bit about solar. I certainly did, and if you need more information about the company or solar energy and renewables, uh, there's a link in the video description below. If you like the content, hit like and subscribe. Uh, there's gonna be more videos coming out here. And if you need any expert real estate advice regarding buying or selling your home, get in touch with me, happy to help you out. See you in the next video.